Hey guys, thanks for joining me. I wanted to share another circuit that I uh, threw together here. A Q multiplier circuit. I've built uh, numerous uh, circuits like this and shared those uh, on YouTube. This one's very, very simple and uh, somewhat similar to the others. You can see the uh, components. So just one resistor, one JFET one capacitor in one variable linear 10k pot again i've got my uh, ferrite antenna here wound and i'll share more details on that when i pull up the schematic and of course the uh, variable capacitor powered by a 9 volt battery again there's uh, two ways to connect this close proximity here to the built-in loop stick in between these two points and again, I'm listening over to uh, Statesville, North Carolina. I'll turn the volume up here in just a minute and I'll demonstrate the uh, Q multiplier in uh, operation. I can also leverage the uh, capacitor here that you see, just place some jumpers there and uh, tie that back into a receiver that has an external antenna input. So you can hear no signal whatsoever. So definitely makes a world of difference. Again, we're amplifying the signal. Of course, the Q multiplier is nothing more than an oscillator. Just before oscillation starts to happen, that's the reason for the uh, 10K pot. You get this big boost in signal. And again, that energy is being coupled here from the uh, ferrite back to the uh, built-in loop stick antenna here. Adjusting the amount of oscillation using the uh, 10k pot and of course the uh, variable capacitor that uh, creates a tank circuit here with the uh, ferrite antenna. You can check out the uh, video description for a link to the schematic. Definitely the simplest um, Q multiplier that I've built. Thanks for watching. And Fort Dobbs Hardware right now for their winter clothing sale. Hardware's got you covered in style. 406 Turnersburg Highway in Statesville.